Well, because I'm very excited about this new force in British politics. I think Brexit has really finally finished off uh, confidence in the way our system works, and I think people are looking for something new and different. And my values very much align with uh, Change UK, so I'm delighted to be able to work with them. What's the likelihood of you being selected as an MEP and what region would you like to represent? For example, would you like to stand for the southwest region of England and Gibraltar again? Of course, yes, of course. I live in the southwest. I've represented the southwest and Gibraltar for 10 years. Uh, the likelihood of it happening? I don't know. Change UK have had, I believe, and the last I saw was a couple of thousand applications. And they'll all be good quality people, I'm sure. So um, I would hope that I would be on any shortlist. After all, I, I am a sitting MEP, so I have a lot of very relevant experience. But then it's up to me to convince them that I'm the right person for the job. Well, given Brexit uncertainty at the moment, how likely do you think it is that the UK will even take part in these European elections? I see no prospect of the two main parties who really have let us down on this. I see no prospect of them being suddenly able to, to get together. So, no, I think we're very likely to take part in these elections. I, I think we're even more likely now uh, to end up with a people's vote, so a confirmatory referendum, which I would expect to take place in September. And I would hope that by October the 31st, we'll be in the position where we have voted not to leave the European Union. How effective can an MEP be, given that the UK is still on course to leave the European Union? British MEPs, when we come back in September, um, at the beginning, end of August, beginning of September, will have exactly the same status as they have now. They, you know, there, is, there are no second-class memberships of the European Union for member states or for MEPs. That's absolutely clear. So I expect new MEPs, if they're elected, to be able to take part 